Hello, I'm Luke Michael Howard, clinical hypnotist and owner of Luke Gnosis Hypnosis. And I am here today with a very special guest. Uh, it's a client called Rochelle who came to see me um, about nine or ten years ago, I think it was. So she'll correct me if mm -hmm. I'm wrong. Um, yep, for right. um, some hypnosis to stop smoking. Um, Rochelle, it's been about eight or nine years. How are you doing? Oh, no, it's paused. Oh, no. Oh, no. Rochelle, are you there? Yes. Yeah, you just disappeared off my screen. <laughs> you just you just paused for me. All right, so if this is a problem, we, we might, because i got a client like that right after. Not your fault. Don't worry. Um, okay. Let's see if we can do it. If not, we'll, we'll, we'll just do it another day. Yes. So I'm going to do that yes. bit again. I don't know what happened, but I'm yes. just going to start. Three, two, one. Hello, I'm Luke Michael Howard, clinical hypnotist and owner of Luke Gnosis Hypnosis. And I'm here for a very special video today, catching up with a client, Rochelle, that I saw um, to help us stop smoking about eight or nine years ago. Rochelle, how are you? I'm doing well, thank you. Thank you. Excellent. Beautiful. Good to see you. Um, thank so, you. Um, Thank you for agreeing to do this. Um, just wanted to catch up with uh, some old clients that had come to see me for for particular issues and just check years down the line and um, how they are and if, if the change that they did with me stuck. So um, if you wouldn't mind um, telling people why you decided to, to come and see me initially. Um, well, I tried numerous things and over the years I was like, I've got, I was starting and stopping smoking the patch, the gum, you name it, willpower. And uh, I just thought, you know what? I'm going to try hypnosis. I have uh, nothing to lose at this point, you know. And it was to stop smoking, right? Correct. Excellent. And um, now, listen. There's there's a lot of other hypnotists. What what was it about me that 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 caused you to reach out to me and 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 come see me to help you? Um, honestly, I just looked online, and you're right. There's quite a few hypnotists, and uh, you've got. Uh, quite a few videos posted and I looked, I watched your videos and your reviews and I ended up signing up for your uh, group hypnosis uh, stop smoking session. And uh, that's how I found you. So it wasn't even one-on-one. -on -one. It was a small group. If memory serves me right. When I used to do that back in the day and um, yes. which usually a small group we have some success um it's more successful than anything other than one-on-one -on -one hypnosis when we look at studies but it wasn't even just pure one-on-one -on -one work so we had we, we hadn't spoke on the telephone or you hadn't mm -hmm. filled out like a big long application form it's just you showed up oh. to where i was doing yes. this a group of other people to quit smoking right yes that's correct and the thing with the group smoke stop smoking is because i don't know everyone and we haven't i haven't had that same interaction as i would in a one-on-one -on -one session um I'm, I'm having to do a more general approach as the more specific approach mm -hmm. that is even more powerful one-on-one -on -one. um so that's that's the full disclosure of that so so what was it what was happening in your life that caused you to give me well to, to come to the group hypnosis um i just got to a point i was just tired of smoking you know I was just why am I still doing this and you always say oh next year or I'll wait till after Christmas or and it's just you know you just keep kicking the can down the road and and, and that's the thing you really need to want to quit because that I was just like I'm done that's it I did my leg work I'm getting this done and that was it so and uh yeah I haven't looked back Wow. And um, yeah, yeah. what what had you tried before? Because typically when people come to see me, I'm not their first call. They've often <laughs> tried a whole host of other things. Did you remember all the other stuff you had tried to quit smoking before you came to see um, me? Yeah, I I tried the gum once. It was terrible. Uh, I did the patch a few times. Um I also did, uh, well, willpower, of course, and I also did a uh, stop smoking book. You know, the power, uh, yeah, it was uh, just a book to help you stop smoking. And everything so, had limited success, but yeah. yeah. So it wasn't like you were sitting on your butt 
and you were just like, oh, one day I'm going to wake up and be a non-smoker. You actually actively went out there and tried. I think I counted three, four, five different things that you had attempted, and, and none of it for stuck. Sure. None of it worked for no. you as in made no, you a non-smoker. That's right. Yeah. What 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 were your thoughts on hypnosis, hypnotherapy before you came and, and worked with me? And you can be honest. Um, yeah. Um. I was a little nervous, but at, at that point, you know, I was in my early 40s and I thought I had nothing to lose. And the thing you'll find are people who have had hypnosis is, you know, after the session was done and whatnot, it's you're you're waiting for something to happen. That's the weird part. It's like, OK, when's the switch going on? But it's just weird. It's strange. Nothing happened. Nothing hopped in the car and normally that was my first, as soon as I hopped in, even if I was going down the road, light up a cigarette. But I didn't. I left the session and I thought, okay, you know, maybe I just don't want one. But it's just so weird that an hour later, you know, you go from being a smoker to just, it's like I never smoked again. It would, it was just, you know, yeah, it was just uh, painless, <laughs> really. Yeah. It's weird, isn't it? But in a good way. Yeah, for sure. 100%. And if memory serves me right, the group session was, what, it's about an hour, an hour and a half max, eh? It, it was around that, yeah. And there was, uh, I can't remember if there was three other people or four. Like I yeah. said, it was about, uh, yeah, nine years ago, ten and years nine ago. Years, well, nine years ago. Yeah, yeah. And, um, and, and do you remember how many you were smoking roughly a day back then, nine years ago? Uh, I was about half a pack a day smoker. About half a pack. and do, Maybe how, 10 to 15. That was the average, yeah. 10 to 15. And, and roughly, how long were you smoking before you came to see me? <laughs> that I really picked it up like a trooper? Um, I'd say probably 18. Like, I, I dabbled in it in high school. Like, I, yeah. I was the person that wouldn't really buy the packs of cigarettes. I'm like, oh, I'll just have one now. You know, and it's like one turns to two. And, and yeah, by the time I was 18, I was, um, yeah, I was hooked. I was a... <laughs> And of, course, you're only, and of course, you're only 21 now, right? Right? Oh, my right. God. That yeah. that cream is working once. Yeah. The Botox as well. Um, right. So, that's right. So, so 20, a minimum of 20 years that you were smoking. You tried all this other business. You, you, you came to me in a little barn that I had somewhere with four <laughs> other people. The barn was yes. really hot, if memory serves me right. And after yes. an hour, hour and a half, you left. And where mm -hmm. the patches, the gum, the Alan Carr uh, book, and anything else yeah. you tried, you just didn't do it again? No, no. I haven't smoked a cigarette since. There's going to be some cynical people out there, right, that are going to figure, A, you're an actress, or you're a stooge, <laughs> that I found you somewhere on Fiverr, and I'm paying you $5 yeah. for, because this is yeah. what some people do to get this, or, or you're an yeah. actress somewhere. So, so are you an actress? Um, no, I'm not. <laughs> Did I book you off Fiverr for five dollars for this? <laughs> no, I, I'm I'm worth more than that. <laughs> Thank you. Absolutely, <laughs> you are awesome. Um, and I know it's been a while, and the, the reason I like to do this so long after is some people think, oh, oh, well, if, if it does work. Um, then it might only be a quick fix. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is nine years later. This is why mm -hmm. this is why we do this. And I know it's mm -hmm. been a while, but can you even remotely remember what happened in the in the hypnosis session? Um, I can't really remember specifics. Um, I believe you brought us, you know, just memory serves me correct we went back to you know when you first started smoking and the memory of smoking and i don't know why i don't even know if the, i don't know why i have this in my head but it's it was about like picture or look at the dirty ashtray i don't know if that's what but like i said it was a while ago but it was just um yeah i mean it was nothing like uh you know stand on your one leg and and hop around like well uh, you know it was you know I, I didn't, all, I didn't yeah. make you bark like a dog or meow. Like no. A... No. All right. That's good. Some people are worried <laughs> about that stuff. So we need to realize yeah. that's that's only yeah. for the stage stuff. Um, yeah. You touched upon it a little bit earlier, but I'll, I'll maybe expand upon it a little bit. Um, how did you feel 
after the session? The best way I can describe it is you leave feeling like you never were a smoker. I, I can't, like I felt just calm, relaxed, and it was just like you think about it out of habit. But I never once thought, oh, I, I need to go buy some or I better reach for one or, you know, I just, I don't know, just a sense of calm, I guess, would be the best, um, you know. Yeah. Sense of calm. Awesome. Yeah. When you when you look at your life now, what are you most looking forward to going forward? What are you most excited about? Um. Well, adding a few years to my life, that's for sure. <laughs> You know, uh, just, um, you know, we never know what's in the cards for us. But, you know, if you, we can do everything on our end to make sure, you know, we make the right decisions and try and stay healthy. It's just, you know, yeah, health is wealth, you know. <laughs> health is wealth. Awesome. Um, to the people out there that are watching this, that are smokers or they're vaping and they want to quit. But there's a part mm -hmm. of them that doesn't want to quit. So they're kind of on the fence. They're like, I oh, know I should mm -hmm. quit, but I'm kind of getting something from this. But And they know deep down they need to quit. But they're all obviously doing it because they're getting some kind of payoff on some unconscious level. But they're watching this and they're like, oh, should I do this or not? You know, I've been smoking long enough now. I've probably done the damage. This hypnosis is a bit weird. Nothing else has worked for me. The books, the gun, the patches. Why should I give this a shot? They're on the fence. What would you say to those folks? First of all, I'd say you have to really want to quit. And secondly, I'd say, honestly, what the cost of, like, what it costs per pack of cigarettes these days. I work with smokers. It's, it's ridiculous. And, like, it's just crazy. And, you know, for a small investment, which will be, you know, you pack cigarettes it is so worth it like you have nothing to lose when you've got nothing to lose you know if you really want to quit and you've tried everything else and you have nothing to lose then <laughs> why are you still thinking about it you know that's what i would have to say i just did a little bit of math right on my calculator she was just talking i was oh. multitasking you were smoking and about about half a pack a day right yeah. approximately nine ten years it's been yeah. And, and and the pack's about $20, right? Give or take. Well, now, yeah, it's around that. People at work, they said it's just, you know, I, I was just like, what? Like, some of it's over $20, honestly. Yeah. Wow, that's yeah. crazy. So I've done, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm actually, I'm going to do that math again. So $20 times 365, well, minus that by half, because you've been doing half a pack a day, well, times by nine, nine years, it's been about nine years, so you've saved. I've never done this before. Do you okay. want to do you want to guess roughly how much how much you've saved in dollars over the last nine years? Ten thousand. I'm just throwing oh. that out there. Oh no! Don't know if you can see that. I'll say it as well. Oh yeah, thirty-two thousand eight hundred. Thirty-two thousand. So just just short of thirty-three grand. That's a half a pack a day yeah. over the last nine years. Yeah, it's a lot of money. That's it is. It is now. Even back then, I think when I quit, what were they? Twelve dollars, eleven dollars a pack, twelve, something like that. Like it was, yeah. yeah. But that was still a lot. So I couldn't yeah. imagine paying twenty. <laughs> exactly. That's that's yeah. amazing. Yeah. Um yeah. what would you what's the most important thing in achieving your success with me, would you say? The most important. It's just, you help me feel free. I, that's the best way I can describe it. Like, you know, I didn't, I used to have that anxiety, especially when everything started, you know, went non-smoking years ago. It was like, oh, can I smoke there? Is there a smoke? You just feel free because you don't think about it. It's peace of mind. And, and that's, yeah. Yeah. And thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Peace of mind and freedom. I always do this at the end because sometimes I forget. Is there anything you'd wish I asked you about this or anything else that you would like to say? Um, no, I think we covered it. Beautiful. Yeah.
Thank you so much, Rochelle, for agreeing to do this. Um, yes, if you're of smoking course. and you want to quit, um, reach out, book your free screening call with me. It's free. You've got nothing to lose other than that nasty habit of quit smoking. So as I like to always say at the end of these videos, you can also quit smoking. And nine years later, we can make a video like this with you and you can save $33,000. <laughs> always believe.